Hi guys, today we're going to talk about Prince Harry. We're going to talk about his book. I'm sure that you've heard about the news of when it's coming out. After weeks, months of speculation on whether it's going to be cancelled, it's going to be coming out. Finally, Penguin, which is the company that publishes Prince Harry's book, has announced via his CEO that the book will be coming out in January, on the 10th of January next year, 2023. Now, it was an announcement that took by surprise the same tabloids that were saying that Prince Harry was desperate to do something. For once, we'll hear Prince Harry in his own words on what happened in his life. When I say what happened in his life, when he was growing up, we have to say that Prince Harry has a unique experience. He's 37 years old. He's lived something that us have not lived in our entire lifetime. People say, yeah, he's too young. No, he's not too young. He's going to talk about something that has been speculated about, has been talked about, but now we have a first account of what happened in his own life. When I say that he has a unique experience, he has a unique experience as the son of a king, the son of Prince Charles and Diana, who were the most famous couples of the 80s and 90s. This alone is material for a lot. So he's now going to be talking about one person in the royal family in particular. He's going to talk about his life and what revolved around. I think that the style they were going to go for would be Prince Harry as the main character talking about events with people revolving around him, talking about how he felt, what he saw, how he analyzed it and how he thought about the events within the perspective of a 12-year-old when his mom died, when he was four years old, when he saw the paparazzi tracking his mother, when he was 20-something, when he went to war, when he was 30-something, when he married Meghan Markle, when he was a few years old, when he saw the press talking about his parents' divorce, his parents' love lives, the way his mom was treated basically. So yes, I'm looking forward to it because I think that it's going to be one of the most exciting book, the richest in terms of content, historical content. And yeah, it's Prince Harry's voice. And I'm sure that it's going to be so successful that movies will be done off that book because it will be so personal knowing Prince Harry, how he is, how personal he is, how open he is about his life, how analytic he is when he talks about his feelings and his mental health and everything. I think it's going to be worth a read. I'm reserving my money already for the 10th of January to buy it. I think we're going to be able to pre-book it online. I'm not sure when and how. So I'll check that. As soon as I have the information, I'll be able to put it here. So yeah, let's go and buy it when it comes out. Have you seen the cover? The book itself, we call the spare. Spare as in hair and spare. You know that in England, there always has to be a spare to the hair. So the hair is the first son of the king who is going to inherit the throne. But in case something happens to him, there should be another child. The spare, in this case, is Prince Harry or was Prince Harry because now the spare is Princess Charlotte. So I think it's going to be wonderful. So I can't wait for it. Let me know what you think. Hope you like the video. Feel free to click on like if it's the case. Subscribe for more videos and click on the notification bell to be notified when I post a new video. Thank you.